to inject quantum mechanics into our understanding of things like black holes. And that's where Hawking proved that black holes are not completely black. Astrophysics, the branch of science that seeks to understand the universe and the way it works, has long been interested in the mysterious concept of black holes. Black holes are regions in space with such immense gravitational pull that nothing, not even light, can escape from them. Their existence was first theorized through Einstein's theory of general relativity in the early 20th century, and over the years, extensive research and observations have reinforced their significance in our understanding of the cosmos. One of the tools researchers used to figure out the realities of space is the James Webb Space Telescope. While it wasn't meant to study black holes since the focus is on the entirety of observable space, it's bound to pick up information about black holes too. But the problem is the information it's picked up is the exact opposite of what we were expecting. Brian Greene has just confirmed the recent finding, and it turns out, according to the James Webb Space Telescope, black holes aren't real. Join us as we bring you all the details, telescopic imagery from the Event Horizon Telescope of the black hole in M87 that ripped on the fabric space was the most direct evidence about this shocking discovery and how it's turned the world of science upside down. Black holes are cosmic entities predicted by Albert Einstein's theory of general relativity. According to this theory, massive objects deform the entire fabric of space-time, creating what we perceive as gravity. When a star runs out of its nuclear fuel and undergoes a supernova explosion, its core collapses under the sheer force of gravity. If the remaining mass exceeds a critical limit known as the Chandrasekhar limit, the gravitational collapse becomes irreversible, leading to the formation of a black hole. But even with that, black holes have always been theorized about since their initial discovery. While black holes themselves can't be directly observed because of the way they're created, Scientists have identified several key characteristics and properties through indirect observations. As light from background stars or galaxies passes near a black hole, its path is bent by immeasurable gravity, creating a gravitational lensing effect. While it sounds absolutely trippy, it's the only thing that allows astronomers to detect and study black holes indirectly by actually studying their gravitational influence on surrounding objects. So what's around the black hole is very important here. When matter from nearby stars or gas clouds falls toward a black hole, it forms an accretion disk around the black hole. These vibrations created by the black hole rippling through the gas cloud. These vibrations are then picked up on the planet Earth, massaged by a computer, amplified by 57 octaves. The material in the disk becomes superheated and emits X-rays, providing another observable signature of black holes. The vision or interaction of black holes with other massive objects can produce gravitational waves, ripples in space-time, which were directly detected for the first time in 2015. So there are both very old and new observations that have been made over time. Over the decades, extensive astronomical observations and advances in technology have provided quite compelling evidence supporting the existence of black holes. Gravitational lensing has offered a look into the distorted light from background objects, indicating the presence of massive objects with intense gravitational fields. Plus, X-ray emissions from accretion disks around invisible objects have matched theoretical predictions for black holes. Not only that, but the detection of gravitational waves, specifically from the merger of black holes, has provided direct confirmation of these powerful entities. The James Webb Space Telescope is a technological marvel that was created to revolutionize astrophysics, and it has not disappointed in its mission to uncover the secrets of the cosmos. As researchers eagerly wait for its data, they were not prepared for the astounding revelations it would bring. Armed with the state-of-the-art observatory, scientists went on a journey that led them to make extraordinary claims that challenged the very existence of black holes. Yes, Researchers utilizing just two data have reported intriguing phenomena that appear inconsistent with our traditional understanding of black holes. Some of these findings have pointed to the possibility of alternative explanations for the things. We always thought were proof of black holes, and well, let's just say that the world of space exploration has done a complete 180. One of the problems has to do with gravitational lensing. With the JWST, these advanced observational capabilities researchers are expected to witness familiar gravitational lensing patterns that align with our understanding of black holes. The light should bend. There should be that big black hole of nothingness that's causing light to distort. However, 
Some of the observed gravitational lensing events presented strange to us. You know when matter falls toward a black hole and forms an accretion disk around it, the superheated material emits X-rays which are detectable by telescopes. These X-ray emissions are among the key observable signatures used to identify black holes and study their properties. If the black hole's mass goes up by the amount of mass that falls in, but even that concept is being turned around on its head with the JWST. Scientists have scrutinized regions suspected to contain black holes, observing their X-ray emissions in greater detail. Unexpectedly, certain black hole candidates have shown peculiar patterns in their X-ray emissions that challenge the conventional understanding of these cosmic entities. The expected variations in X-ray brightness, spectral characteristics, or timing properties have left researchers wondering if traditional black hole models adequately account for these emissions. This uncertainty has given rise to alternative explanations that explore the possibility of other exotic compact objects or modified gravity theories. One of these has to do with gravitas. These hypothetical objects have captured the imagination of astrophysicists as they present a unique twist on the classic black hole theory. In the gravitas model, the exterior still appears similar to a black hole following the well-known metric that describes gravity's behavior around such massive objects. However, a fascinating twist lies within its core. Instead of a singularity like the one postulated in traditional black holes, gravitas have more of a deep metric inside. What takes things even further is its event horizon, which hosts a thin shell of matter. This peculiar configuration sets gravitas apart from conventional black holes and prompts scientists to consider intriguing possibilities. The Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory, LIGO, has also played a pivotal role in our overall journey to explore the cosmos. Detecting gravitational waves from distant cosmic collisions has allowed LIGO to provide valuable insights into the nature of compact objects. Plus, in some instances, the gravitational waves detected by LIGO have also exhibited characteristics that are completely indistinguishable from those of ordinary black holes. So, something is going on here in the realm of astrophysics and general relativity. The no-hair theorem has long stood as a prominent principle shaping our understanding of black holes. According to this theorem, all stationary black hole solutions to the Einstein-Maxwell equations, which describe the gravitational and electromagnetic forces, possess a unique set of characteristics. These specific attributes are the black hole's mass, angular momentum or spin, and electric charge, collectively referred to as the black hole's hair. The no-hair theorem suggests that any other distinguishing features of a black hole beyond its mass, spin, and charge are considered hair and are believed to be lost beyond the event horizon. This event horizon acts as an impenetrable boundary beyond which information is seemingly irretrievable from an external observer's perspective. So, to put it in one sentence, conventional black holes have been thought of as relatively simple and devoid of any further distinguishing properties. However, in a remarkable study by Sasha Hako, Stephen Hawking, Malcolm Perry, and Andrew Strominger, they challenged this traditional view of black holes. Their groundbreaking research presents the existence of what they call soft hair in black holes, suggesting a more complex structure than anyone previously thought. Thanks for watching Worldview Theory.